It's planting season in Lebanon's Bekaa Valley. Farmers have been growing cannabis in the wild every year for decades. But ever since the war in Syria began, a new drug has emerged here. Captagon, produced in factories across northern Lebanon and banned by the UN because of its dangerous chemical makeup. 78 million pills were seized here in the last two years, most of them destined for serious front lines. We gained exclusive access to a former Daesh fighter who told us he first came across Captagon when he joined the group. They started bringing us these pills. With every pill, you stay up for three days. You don't feel anything except that you're awake. When the enemy comes, you see him as a pig, a monster, and you want to kill him. All the armed militias are taking these pills, and whoever claims they're not taking these pills isn't actually fighting. When nighttime fell, we drove to a safe house to meet his drug dealer, who also wanted us to hide his identity. Since the situation in Syria became chaotic, freedom of movement became easier. There is no order and no government in Syria. The pills are distributed to different provinces. They reach Raqqa, Derazur, Aleppo and Damascus. Okay, let's show one. So there are 300 pills uh, in, in this bag, and if you actually take a look at them, they, they look like aspirin, and each one of them costs $5. So the total market value of this bag is $1,500. Mohammed says he nets $10,000 a month from his deliveries to Syria. And as long as the war continues, his profit margin can only grow. Zaina Awad, TRT World, the Bekaa Valley, Lebanon.